Hi, good morning. Today we are going to do an experiment to demonstrate osmosis. Before going to do the experiment, once we remind the definition of osmosis. The movement of water molecules from low concentration point to high concentration point through a semi-permeable membrane is called osmosis. This transportation does not require energy. For doing this experiment, we need some materials such as hydrochloric acid, two beakers, cloth, two rags, spoon, a strip of paper and salt. First we have to prepare dilute hydrochloric acid solution in two beakers. Then take two raw eggs and keep them in both the beakers containing dilute hydrochloric acid for 4 to 5 hours. Observe carefully what happening here. Some gas bubbles are evolving from eggshell. Why does the gas bubbles are evolving from the eggshell? Eggshell made of calcium carbonate. It reacts with acid to form calcium chloride and gives out carbon dioxide gas. So these gas bubbles are carbon dioxide. Due to this reaction, within 4 to 5 hours, eggshell dissolves in dilute hydrochloric acid. Hence, we get egg without shell. Carefully take out the eggs by using a spoon. Next, wash the eggs in tap water and wipe them by using a cloth carefully. From here, we must handle the eggs with care. Why? Because now the eggs are without shell, surrounded by a thin layer called egg membrane. Nothing but plasma membrane. This membrane acts as a semi-permeable membrane. Now, measure the circumference of each egg with a long strip of paper and mark on the paper with a pen. Here, the size of both eggs are same. Next, take two beakers and prepare concentrated salt solution in one beaker and take fresh water in another beaker. Place one egg in salt water while another egg in fresh water. Leave them for 4 to 5 hours.
Observe carefully. The egg placed in salt water shrinks, while the egg placed in tap water swells. Take out the eggs from beakers and measure their circumferences with the same strip of paper. Observe carefully. The size of egg placed in salt water decreased. While the size of egg placed in tap water increased. Why does the shrinking and swelling of eggs take place? This occurs due to osmosis. In the first beaker, salt water is more concentrated than albumin present in the egg. These two solutions are separated by egg membrane. Already we know that egg membrane acts as semi-permeable membrane. Hence, water molecules move from low concentration point that is albumin to high concentration point that is salt water so that the egg present in salt water shrinks. While in the second beaker, albumin present in the egg is more concentrated than the fresh water. Hence, water molecules move from fresh water to albumin so that the egg present in the fresh water swells. In the first situation, water molecules leave the cell. This process is called exosmosis. In the second situation, water molecules enter into the cell. This process is called endosmosis. Osmosis plays a major role in absorption of water by root hairs. Root hairs grow out into the spaces between the soil particles. Root hairs are surrounded by moisture. Soil water is more dilute than the plasma of the cells of root hairs. Cell membrane acts as semi-permeable membrane. Due to osmosis, water moves from soil to cells of the root hair. Okay, children. Study well, grow well, be a good citizen and proud to be an Indian. Thank you.